Hello everyone. I decided to make a little bit longer video today about um, Twin Flame Energy because there is so much information out there. There is so much um, uh, misinformation, I would say. And um, I really want to make this video from my purest intention, from the heart, from my own experience, from what I understand about Twin Flames. But mostly, I mean, I have been studying it, studying it, meaning living it, for the last year and a half um, and I had no idea what is happening. All I knew is that that was completely different from what I have ever experienced in any romantic relationships before. So <clears throat> my path led me to Twin Flames and naturally it was a very, very natural process um, for me it led me, um, and I have been already on my spiritual journey, so I need to go back to my intention. This intention is, really comes from my pure heart, from my soul, to really clarify a lot of uh, misbeliefs, and um, I hope this video will really help you to understand that the twin flame um, it's literally only energy. It's an energy. And once we understand it, and I believe it's really hard for people to understand this concept because you can only <laughs> truly understand what is going on when you are experiencing it. So first of all, I would like to talk about, I get comments and um, a lot of comments saying it's a cult. So this is what I want to say. Um, any ideology, really, any religion, any faith, you can technically label as a cult. Because it's basically an experience humans have on this earth. So Twin Flames, it's not a cult. Yes, it can Anything, literally, any religion, any faith can be turned into a cult. Absolutely, 100%. And that's why you have to have discernment on this journey. And this journey, because again, it's a spiritual journey. And most people, it's, it's so hard to grasp this concept because when you're on this journey, your mind literally takes you back to the 3D regular relationship. And that's when everything gets mixed up and everything, that's why everything gets so confusing. From my own experience, it's only when you basically, something clicks, you go through the process, you go through a horrendous pain that you literally almost die. And on an energetic level, you literally die. Part of you dies because you um, shed your old skin and you shed your own beliefs. You shed your own understanding of what love really is. Um, and you come more into your essence, into who you truly are meant to be in this lifetime. So is it a cult? I don't think so. Because a cult is something that you blindly follow without any discernment, um, without any questioning on your part, without any um, consideration of the truth that lies underneath. That would be a cult. So if you, um, if from your experience, you're just following it, or maybe maybe that was your experience, that it turned out to be a cult. And I don't, um, I can't speak to that. That is absolutely, it can be real for some people. But what I want to talk about is the energy. What it really is, is the energy. When you two meet, and of course, you're a human, so you think it's a romantic partner, it's a beautiful romantic uh, connection you feel, and you want to be for, with this person for the rest of your life. You just feel all of these beautiful feelings. And then all of a sudden, 
you realize that you realize that you, this person triggers your biggest awakening, your biggest sh ego death, your biggest inner work and shadow work. So all I want to say is that this experience transcends anything we know about love and about relationships. Twin flame journey is literally an energetic deepest biggest spiritual spiritual journey you have ever been on so i wanted to bring it i wanted to clarify what my intention really is about when i speak about twin flames and i absolutely understand that if you are not on this journey it is very very difficult to grasp this concept because it's out of this earth <coughs> This experience is literally something that's very hard to describe. I'm having a very hard time using the language, the 3D language, to describe the sensations and the feelings and this experience. Because um, what I have experienced in my Twin Flame connection is absolutely out of this world and... Mm, it's it's a lot of visions, a lot of felt experiences in your physical body that I cannot describe it in in the language. And I'm trying to. Once I got to the point in my journey when I felt, I literally felt guided to start speaking about it. Um, I'm trying to find the language and I'm trying to be more descriptive about what I have experienced and what it really is. And I get insights literally from the universe, from my own guidance and how I speak about it. It's, I know it is the truth. It's, a, it's my truth. And if you don't agree with it, I, I, I respect it fully. You just scroll, um, keep scrolling keep uh, watching different videos because it might not resonate with everyone not not many people are really on this journey so i want to make another point very important point about twin flame journey is that validating that this person is your twin flame and that you are on the twin flame journey is a process and it will take your time it will take you time. It will take time because it's the, um, you know, I noticed it was, it has been a battle between your mind and your heart. Your heart, your soul already knows. And I have goosebumps when I talk about it because that's the truth. You already knew, you knew this person when you came with energy of the other person you um it's undeniable you know it you feel it and that's why this urge the sensation to merge with this person is so strong it's so strong that it transcends everything you are uh, thinking and you can grasp because in 3d the twins have very hard time to come into union and that's on purpose it's a divine plan, so you can navigate this journey, this difficulties, this obstacles, and trust. Trust your own soul and slow down to really become one with you. So I hope I um, clarified a little bit. I was guided today to make this video and specifically about explaining about is this a cult? I've heard um, when I was on this journey and I was, um, you know, look, literally looking for everything outside of me for the answers and watching a lot of videos on Twin Flames. And I know there is a lot of um, um, deception in this community. Like in any other spiritual community, they're always in every area of your life, you will find deceptive energies. So you have to use your discernment. You have to use your discernment. And that's actually what the journey is all about, to really trusting your discernment. So if something doesn't resonate, if you don't feel comfortable or you're still questioning, keep questioning. Keep questioning because this is what the journey is about, to question everything you believe in.
and eventually your soul will lead you to the truth. You will know the truth by the way it feels in your body, in your being, and you literally will become one with everything. So a cult, a real cult, will never bring you to your own truth. So keep my only advice if you're questioning whether you're on this journey or not, and if you're going back and forth and you're literally losing your mind, that is absolutely normal. That's part of the process. And keep coming to your own inner work, to your own energy. My biggest advice is to really feel the energy. Feel the energy and the mind will keep coming in. And of course, you have to listen to the mind because, uh, you know, it's hard to, um, you know, some of the things the mind will tell you are absolutely true as well. This journey can be very um hurtful it can be very painful on the level of the other person can really hurt you on a deepest level and yet you find this incredible unconditional love and forgiveness because they are literally reflecting you so it's you are loving yourself by loving them you are forgiving yourself by forgiving them And that's what your soul knows. And that's what your soul wanted you to understand all along. I hope this helps a little bit to clarify. I will be making more videos and I really want to organize my videos because I want them to um, be on point and the energy is so strong and I've been balancing it. I feel way more balanced now and I'm ready to talk about it in a more balanced way. So if this resonates with you, subscribe and listen to my messages as I will be, the universe will guide me and I will be sharing with you um, what's the most aspects of this journey are. Take care. I love you.